Alright, guys, what's going on, guys? It's your boy, Kree here, bringing you guys another Dokkan Battle video. And this one, uh, we're going to be talking about a very important topic that I would like to go over. Uh, real quick, I want to say that the uh, JP 5 year anniversary is absolutely insane. Um, I've been so overwhelmed with, like, stuff to do that I've not been able to get around to everything. Um, on top of, like, the JP stuff, um, there is, like, some other, like, content-wise, content stuff on the channel I've been get, getting around to, like, the Borderlands. Borderlands is just really dry. I'm still trying to keep at least one video a day of Borderlands content on the channel. However, it is, um, a little bit much to try and balance all this Goken stuff, all that stuff. And then I have another big project that I got coming on Sunday. It's just a lot, alright? Y'all gotta cut me some slack. I wouldn't have this video out last night, but, um... I was up for like 38 hours and my body just wouldn't let me so i just kind of i crashed for over 12 hours all right but regardless we're here um this is pre-recorded footage um my mic wasn't uh actually plugged in when i was recording this um gameplay so this is a, a commentary over it however we're talking about this gogeta in the vegeto these bad boys these year five anniversary units have farmable super attacks uh, we're going to go ahead and take a quick look at the uh, Gogeta one. So for the Gogeta one, you want to come to the uh, Broly movie story event and you want to go to stage 11. Um, you, the reason why you want to come to stage 11 is obviously this is where you get the STR base form Gogeta. Um, and then you turn on our movie heroes team. As you can see, my movie heroes team is a little bit on the weak side. Don't clown on me for it. Uh, once again, I said I've been a bit overwhelmed. Uh, my JP account still has a lot of like do characters. I have to Doken do do Awaken. Like, dude, I have like 20... Uh, characters on my JP account that I have to do in Awaken, which is a lot, and I still have to do all of the farmable, uh, the farmable uh, free-to-play units, and like their easy A's. I've done like hardly none, no easy A's on this account, so I am a little bit behind with the times. Uh, regardless of that, however, we are still here. We're still gonna be uh, go ahead and grinding on this thing. Yeah, um, my free-to-play kill Goku right here. Uh, this guy only has a super attack of five, so uh, don't clown on me too hard for that. And as you can see, my uh, my Super Saiyan Blue or my AGL Gogeta doesn't um, isn't Doken Awaken yet. <laughs> so yeah, um, regardless though, uh, whenever you're doing this event, you do want to make sure you have a Movie Heroes team, obviously because they have a really high chance of getting yourself the uh, copy of the Gogeta card. Um, for the Vegito one, I'm not gonna run it. I'm not gonna run the Vegito event uh, in this video. I will show where to uh, like go if you want to farm up the uh, Vegito. Um, if you uh, for those y'all who are gonna do that for some like free to play care, uh, free to play uh, people out there that are, are gonna do that and not use Kai's, which I highly recommend you do. Um, my Vegito, I had a shit ton of Kai's already like lo uh, ready to go for the anniversary. So I, the I uh, there's no way I was gonna. Um, like try and do it because the other uh, thing about the Vegito essay is that he's a lot harder than uh gogeta's essay because gogeta has a uh, like i want to say it's not a guaranteed drop but a high chance to drop and you can even oh see look we got a character right there speaking about it um and you have a category bonus which you don't have a category bonus when you do the Vegito uh super attack which is something to note and he's a little bit rarer to drop um regardless uh though uh, we did get ourselves a copy of this Gogeta card. So what we're going to do here is we're going to go ahead and we're actually going to try and uh, max out our guy here at SA10. As you can see, I do have him on SA5. I was doing a little bit of that before I started recording. And as you can see, uh, all of the Gogetas that we have, um, I'm going to go ahead and uh, select the first five. And we're going to go ahead and uh, roll to see if we can. Uh, I don't think we can max out the SA, uh, but we should be able to get uh, at least a good amount uh, for sure. Um, if you want to uh, go ahead and get a guaranteed chance on doing uh, on having a guaranteed SA raise for uh, the Gogeta, Gogeta, you can just uh, awaken him to uh, you are, and he'll be 100% chance if you don't want to roll the dice. However, we are going to roll the dice, and we are going to get three super attacks, uh, which is awesome. So I'm actually going to select these four and just leave one copy of the uh, base form Gogeta card, as I actually don't have uh, this card hardly done at all. So we will leave one there, and we're going to go ahead and uh, roll the dice on these four. We should max out our SA. I'd be a little bit mad if we didn't, and we did. Okay, that's awesome. So we got uh, our Gogeta's SA is maxed. We're going to go ahead and hop into the hidden potential, and we are actually going to um, max him out at the 55%. Uh, don't farm me on my Go Goku hidden potential. Come on, guys. I actually do have a nice amount of uh, hidden potential stacked up and ready to go, which is awesome. I did not pull um, any more than the one copy of the Gogeta. 
which is something to note. So I only have them uh, at the 55%. And I have no equipment put on any of my characters. If you guys don't know about that, um, the uh, widespread like opinion on the uh, equipment right now is to wait and hold off after uh, the Awis event goes away. I think at the very end of this anniversary. Uh, so we don't make any like big mistakes because you once you put them on there you can't take them off you put them on there and then they're on there forever unless you put a new one on there and when you do uh the old one is gone forever so uh yeah be a be pretty careful with your uh your equipment there for sure so if we go come uh over to the uh vegeto uh, where he's at uh, there he is right there uh, i already have them at sa10 as you can see at the bottom left uh, i skipped I, I didn't run the sa i didn't even really think about running the farm let's say for vegeto um until i actually like thought about it for the uh, for gogeta's um i already had him at sa10 because i like once i pulled him like after the summoning video was done i immediately i mean i immediately uh went down and i maxed out his sa like super fast without without a hesitation and um i'm gonna I'm, okay where's the uh vegeto uh event that i'm talking about here for the farm let's say i know he's i know he's definitely a bit uh, on the older side of uh, doka events to run and stuff uh where's he at uh goku uh go future gohan and goku okay i should be right okay uh where's he at i know he's old but he's okay he's not that far down jeez and okay right nope okay there he is all right right here so this is the event uh you want to come all the way down here to the slot one and you want to run him on uh z hard uh z hard is the only like level where you can actually unlock uh, not unlock, but have the uh, STR Vegito drop. Uh, STR Vegito. STR Vegito drop. Both of the uh, cards that drop that are yeah, that you use as uh, SA are both STR. You're doing my bad. I got confused. Um, but you do want to um, run uh, Z hard. Uh, this is the only stage that will actually have the Vegito drop. If we actually take a look at it, you'll see right here. Uh, this is the card that I'm talking about. This STR Vegito that's already an SR, but is already awakened into an SSR. Uh, and as you can see, it says right here on Z hard and stuff like that. So you can't awaken this guy, unfortunately, to a UR for a 100% chance. You just got to roll your dice on the 50% uh, chance and stuff. But uh, uh, yeah, guys, that is going to just about wrap up the video. The five-year anniversary is absolutely insane. There's still so much uh, type of content I want to do on here. But I do have to get to grinding on up some of these teams, man. My my units are just just not quite fully awakened yet like some of these other big time uh, Doken tubers are my global account I would be able to do this but uh yeah not a lot of things come to global first unfortunately <laughs> anyways though guys hope y'all did enjoy the video if you guys did enjoy the video then make sure to drop your load on that like button and subscribe if you are new also while you're at it go ahead and give that bell down there a little bit of love tap for me I greatly appreciate it uh, any support I do get is greatly appreciated guys my my doken stuff doesn't get nearly as many views as like my borderlands stuff does uh, but borderlands is unfortunately a bit of a, uh, a slow point there but we're not uh, this isn't a borderlands video this is a dokkan video and stuff I hope this video did help you guys out my name's Cree and I'll see y'all in the next one peace out y'all